Uh, hello. Beautiful, beautiful people of the internet. I'm here today to give you another video. So, if, be, by the way, if you hear my sister in the background crying, she's supposed to be taking a nap. And usually before she takes a nap, she starts crying like a little baby. But, this video today, I want to talk about what's trending. And what's currently trending is this, the thing of summoning demons. Okay, I don't know what's wrong with y'all. I don't know why y'all think this is okay. That this is what the Lord wants. But he don't want y'all bringing spirit, world, demonic things onto the overworld. The living land. Okay? Okay. There is this thing called the Charlie Charlie Challenge. And I'm going to do it for you guys. No, I just said I'm not into demonic stuff, but... Just for you two, I'm going to do it for you guys. So, one second. <sighs> I'm really nervous, you know, guys. Um, Alright, so, here I go. Charlie. Char can miss me with this because I'm not doing that. Now that we've got that out the way, really funny that you guys thought I was going to do that. I'm just going to say, you know... Messing with the spirit world is a dangerous, dangerous game. It really is. And if you have demons, whether it's in your house, whether you do it at school, home, your friend's house, the creepy man down the street, lawn, you're still, like, letting something follow you, which I don't understand. And I wouldn't even, like, I've been thinking I want to do it, but I won't do it. And you want to know why? Because I'm not trying to have no demon follow me around to the day I die. I just don't. I don't want my kids growing up with Uncle Demon. I want my grandkids to know Granddad Demon. It's not going to happen. Because that demon's going to stay around forever. So, but I will say this. If you do the challenge, do the challenge at your own risk. And know that there might be some paranormal activity in the middle of the night. And you might hear a baby crying. And you may not have a baby at all. The other night, yesterday, my mom came in my room and was like, are you crying? I wasn't even crying. I was half asleep. And she thought she heard crying. And I ain't even do the Charlie Charlie challenge. That's another reason why I'm not finna do it. But like I said, do it at your own risk. There are, I do believe in demons and you may not believe in that. And maybe the Charlie Charlie challenge is fake. Maybe it is. Maybe it's not real. Maybe some broke kid who don't have an Ouija board made it up. But whatever the case may be, do it at your own risk. I mean, if you got a demon following around you, don't call me. Unfollow me on Instagram. Unfollow me on Twitter. Don't don't have my number saved because I don't need the, the demon calling me like, what's up? Nah, bro. Mm -mm, nah, B. I'm not with that. Don't call me talking about how you doing. Mm -mm. So, just also, I don't want to see the news people like this. Hi, I'm Sandy Sanderson here to give you your news and your action in the Detroit. Today, there has been an alarming rate of children calling the paranormal activity line talking about they have paranormal activity going on in their homes. They say this is because of the Charlie Charlie challenge. The children calling in rate is currently 26. 27. 30. 35? Nah, B. Let me just break it down to y'all like this. Y'all messing with that demon stuff. And point blank period, if your kids are at home doing that Charlie Charlie challenge, knock that pencil and paper out their hand and tell them to go do some homework. Alright, I'm Sandy Sanderson here with your news. See you guys next Wednesday. So see why you shouldn't do the Charlie Charlie challenge. But like I said, if you're going to do it, do it on your own. But don't contact me. Don't ask me to come over. Don't ask if you can come over because I don't need that Charlie Charlie homie following you to me and making a little pit stop on his way following you here because I ain't, I ain't with that, bro. I mean, the, the kids at my school, they did it today at the lunch table and the whole table completely flipped out. And I guess you're supposed to say goodbye to this demon Make sure you say goodbye, because I've, I've heard it's pretty much like an Ouija board, and if you don't say goodbye, this demon stays, and you just leave a portal open for more demons to come out. 
I don't want no exorcism stuff going on in my school where you levitate up out the chair and you're over here, you know, spazzing your back then almost broke in half. So, yeah. Stay safe, kids, and don't mess with demons. They in hell for a reason. Now, I will see you guys Thursday for sure. I know I've been slacking on Thursday's video. I've been thinking about changing the date, maybe Thursday or, I mean, Tuesday and Saturday or Tuesday and Friday. I just, I don't know, Thursday is... I don't know why I'm just so lazy on Thursday but also give me guys give me feedback guys I've been wanting to do certain segments on here a lot of people really liked my last video and that they all said that I was kind of speaking the truth so I was kind of thinking maybe we could do a little truth segment on this video on this channel or like some trending topic you know videos or like a Q&A or something so let me got let me let me I'm not I'm not possessed, y'all, if y'all thought that. Let me know what you guys want me to do, and I will definitely do it. Leave this video a like, and comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. See you guys. See you guys Thursday for sure. I'm going to make sure I have a video. Not sure what it is. Not sure what it's going to be, but I'm going to see you guys Thursday. Bye, guys.